So we've decided to get out into one of the more remote places that we could think of because of this uh, coronavirus stay in place quarantine. Um, so we headed out to Dos Rios, some place we've never been, but we're pretty sure that uh, there was gonna be nobody out here. So, and there isn't. And man, this place is a freaking gem. But the rock itself is super smooth um, in a lot of places up here you don't have it's not so smooth but as soon as you get closer down to the water it's like the rocks have been rubbed so smooth by the river i don't know how i'm gonna do with it because the friction feels so bad <laughs> but the problems look so good and there just looks like there's so many of them i'm really pumped all right let's try So we've been playing around a lot up here. It's absolutely beautiful. The day is just like sunny. It's probably 70s, um, but yeah, it's great. Haven't seen a soul. Man, the rock is like the, the warm up rock that we were on was very textured, but everything else around here doesn't seem to be very textured. We're searching for things for Jackie to do and then I pointed to this thing and it just happened to be too hard for her, but it's right along that grade level for me, but it's so close to the ground, but I doubt anybody has ever done this. So we're gonna try. <laughs> After lunch, we moved down to the main fork boulders. Kind of looked around, flew the drone a little bit, and uh, proceeded to try to get on a one for Jackie and a four for me. And both of us have flailed excessively. 
the rock here is just so smooth. I could tell that this problem would be a lot easier if you were short because I'm trying to tuck my feet up and I just can't make, I'm not strong enough to lock off this one move and go to this crimp. Feels way harder than it before. Plus, it's kind of tall with a not awesome landing and, and two, two little mad pads don't feel like nearly enough. Neither does one spotter. So, probably not going to do this today. Probably definitely going to come back to do this because it is just such a cool line. It's called Electric Eel V4. It gets four stars in the Northern California guidebook, but man, like this entire place is so cool. Like the difference of the rocks and how slick or, or like friction it can be. And yeah, it's a cool, cool place to come. Highly recommend Dos Rios.